Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Pillars of Eternity, The White March. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that it shows to join me today as we continue moving on in this dangerous, dangerous dungeon filled with monsters like those ones that... Actually, we're fighting this one alone. That's fantastic. You're that is mine. fantastic. Yeah. No, no, Oedipus Ford is on fire. She's on fire. Oh, yeah. But yeah, this guy is gonna die. Yeah, immune to. Yeah, it's no problem. This thing it's is no doing... problem. I think that I touched on in the last episode, I think, is that we don't have ammo. So, back in Baldur's Gate and Icewind Dale and uh, I think Temple of Elemental Evil as well. I'm what pretty sure it? Temple of Elemental Evil also had ammo. So, what happened is if you. Uh, if you faced creatures that were resistant to your, uh, well, ranged weapon, whatever it was, uh, it could be a sling, it could be a, a crossbow, whatever it was. So if you faced it, uh, if you, oh boy, there's there's a lot of them, there's a lot of them. Okay. So yeah, if you if you notice that your weapon was being ineffective, you had to be careful as not to waste your ammo, especially if you were using expensive ammo, which is often the case later in the games. Um, so yeah, that's kind of a bit of a Can't micromanagement do. that it was erased from, um, Just from say the word. Uh, Pillars of Eternity. But I kind of miss it. I kind of miss it. Um, well, I, as I said last episode, of course, we, uh, the advantage of that uh, is, is, I think, offset a little bit by the lack of things like fire arrows and stuff like that. But of course, we have the enchanting system, which kind of offsets that, and then, I don't know, it's just... Okay, unlocking this will require the proper key. Do I have the proper key? Nope, I don't have the proper key. So where do I get the proper key? I don't know where the proper key is. So how could I get the proper key without knowing where the proper key is? Well, that's a question for the ages. The proper ages. Okay, we got a wind blight over there. It's not very... Okay, yeah. You know why it's called a wind blight? Because it smells funny. He ate too many tacos. Actually, I say I I, I I make a joke about tacos, even though I've never seen one in my entire life. How? Okay, so these are wind. Yeah, I've never seen a taco in my entire life. How weird is that? The life of a European dude, I guess. Yeah, we don't have Mexican food food over here. Even though, even though Spider Cat assures me, Spider Cat, if you don't know Spider Cat, just Google it. Uh, but even though Spider Cat assures me that Mexican food is the best thing since sliced bread or something. Yeah, I'm not sure. Not sure. Let's try and heal. Mm, that's gonna be too late. Yeah, it's gonna be too late. Giladel is now down. And uh, that guy's down as well. Let's see what I can do from this side of things. Let's attack this one. We're gonna attack that. We are gonna attack that, even though. Wait. Wait a minute. Are these guys immune? They are immune to. Actually, they are not immune to Pierce, so let's keep going. Keep going with the Pierce. Pierce them all! Okay, that guy is grown. Persistence. Okay. Yeah, we need, you really need to heal everybody in this area. Okay, that was nice, I guess, so... Not you. Let's attack that. Mm, yeah, let's attack that. There we go. Let's hope for the best, and... You heal, you heal. Oh, boy! That is terrible. That is terrible. Adder, please don't die. Please don't die. I won't, Wrong skill. There we go. Okay, so you guys attack that. And uh, you two attack this one, which is almost dead. Adder might die, though. Uh, let's take one of those, if you can. It's not gonna help a lot, but it helps a little bit, so that's all that what well, that's all that matters. Ooh, that was kind of a waste, actually. Kind of a waste. But then again, that was kind of a uh, unexpectedly tough battle. I, 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 as I said last episode, was it a couple me. of episodes ago? I'm trying to be a little bit more risky. Because otherwise, this will just turn into a, I don't know, into a um, kite fest. And I don't really enjoy that all that much. Well, I'm playing, when I'm playing by myself, I can, I can definitely, definitely uh, endure that. I just, oh, what is that? A specter. Okay, a specter is fine, I guess. Let's take care of that first. Okay, that's cool. Um, I just recorded an episode for Wasteland 2, my, my other uh, Let's Play series. One of my other Let's Play series. And uh, I recorded an episode where I had to... But pause the recording in middle, halfway through the episode and kite for like an hour and stuff and that just was unbelievably frustrating and uh, it's the kind of game that uh, Pillars of Eternity can become if you're not careful so okay over here what do we have? Nothing. There's no... Wait. Am I pressing the wrong key? I'm pressing the wrong key, anti. What's the right key? Tell me about the right key! So... Controls. 
Uh, what's the highlight all? Highlight, yeah, it's a tab one. I'm, I was pressing Z. God damn it. Okay, so the tab doesn't show me anything. Oh, there's something over there. What is that for? We've lost an item. The wind prism. Do you speak? You don't speak. Okay. Well, I don't have any more items of that nature, so... I really don't. I have some scolder meat, but I don't think that's gonna work. I don't know what that did, though. Oh, I still... Still have something there. Okay. I can't open this. That's fine. There's something here that I haven't explored, I don't think. Have I? Oh, I have not. Let's see if, it, if there is a trap. I don't think there is, but just in case. Oh, there's the fire prism over there. The fire prism? Have we seen that? I don't think we have. That's So there's four elements. As, as per usual, there's four elements. And there's probably going to be fire stuff over here. So fire elementals aren't really that scary, all things considered. They should be down here somewhere. Is it here, though? Okay, let's bring everyone back there. Adipa's gonna scout ahead because she's a good girl. Who's a good girl? <laughs> okay, let's keep going back here. No, no, she's stunned. God damn you. Yeah, there's no... It's not just... Okay, there's a shade over here. I hate shades. I hate... Actually, I like the shade, but I hate shades. Because they, um, they teleport. And they deal quite a lot of damage as well. So, actually, it might be a little bit better. Oh, yep. Yeah, there we go. Kill that. Okay. So let's see what I can do with Aloth's spells. We got a wall of flame, not gonna be useful. I'm gonna use that right there. And hope for the best. Of course, it's not gonna work. There we go against the flame elementals. Oh, pause the game, thank you. Go ahead and do that. What are you doing? Are you attacking somebody? Attack that. Oh, it's immune to pierce. This one is this one's not. Okay, uh. Keep casting spells, man. Keep casting spells. We have four four level fours? Oh, that's perfect. Go ahead and do that. Actually, these are all... Uh, they might be... Resi yeah, they're immune. I'm just spending my spells for no reason whatsoever. So let's do that instead. How about that? Huh? You prefer that? No, that's that's a bad, a bad, a bad, a bad call. Don't go there. There we go. That's better. If this was... There we go. Poison. Perfect. Okay, so... You two attack that. Uh, yeah, that's good. So you guys keep attacking that Adipus down. Kill that Earth Flight. Otherwise, you might be poisoned soon. And I think Adipa is the only one that went down. And uh, so did the number of level 4 spells on Alot Screamoir. But yeah, that's really not that problematic. And that thing blowed up, I think. Blew up. Okay. That's nice. Some more ingredients. Those are very nice. And we got enemies in here or up there. I don't know where they... No, they are up there. For sure. For sure. Let's go back. Let's not anger them at all. And you too, what about you too? Okay. Same strategy again. I guess I'll have to make do without the spells, though. Because I was kind of being an idiot. Kind of being an idiot. Okay, that guy's gonna come this way. He's immune to stuff. He's immune to pierce. Oh, there's a shade. That is not immune to pierce. Let's attack it. So, you guys attack the fire elemental, disengage all you like. That is going down. Let's mark this prey, huh? Well, oh, yeah, there's more stuff back there. Okay, so do you have. No, we don't have any more of those. So, let's go with Fetid Caress, see if you can caress that guy. Stinking Caress. How do you do that? Do you, do you scratch your ass first and then caress them? That's, that's disgusting, man. Don't do that again. Not on my watch, you're not gonna do that. Okay, so keep attacking that set. There we go. Okay, so you attack that, you attack that, you attack that, and you two attack that. Okay, that's good. Oh, you can't attack that. Okay, attack that. Down. It's fine. We got a flame blight over there. That thing is no more. That's fantastic. I am gonna switch you to I don't know who is he attacking. Adapa. Okay, so let's bring you guys back here. Try to gain a little bit of a breathing room. Let's disengage. Yeah. Adipa is on fire, as usual. <laughs> as usual! Yeah, it's moon. It's moon, I know. So, you go ahead and heal people, because uh, that's important. Uh, cast that, because that's also handy. Uh, and you guys just... I don't care about you. I, I know it's not effective, but whatever. I don't... I couldn't... I couldn't care less. Really. Unless we start dying, in which case I probably will care a little bit more. So I could technically care less. Uh, yeah. So, let's... How do I... 
There we go, death. Death comes to those who flame brightly. Flame? Is that a verb? It has to be a verb, right? Because every single noun in English can become a, a verb. Yeah. Anyway, uh, so you, sir, are might are might be dying, sir, soon. So let's not are dying very fast. No. There we go. Kill it. Kill it with fire. No, with fire, not with fire, because they're immune to that, I think. So kill it with crushing damage. Oh, Giladel perished. That was bad. Yeah, we need to we need to rest. We need Just to go say back the up. Word. I will say the word, but not right now. Not right now. We'll go we'll go upstairs soon. Don't worry. So this is, I think, let's go here, let me stay first, let's go down here and see what awaits us in here, hopefully and only shadows, yeah, only shadows, but not the kind of shadows I was hoping for, if I'm honest, so Giladel is right at the front, which is terrible, so she's gonna disengage, she's gonna get away from there, she's actually quite good at disengaging, she doesn't really need to use that escape, escape uh, spell all that much, oh, there's another shadow back here, what is that? Uh, but in some enemies, some enemies are better at hitting her. Shades are not so much, so there we go. Oh, there's another one. I, I didn't see that. Eloth is now under attack. Your enemies have assailed... Oh, no. Yeah. That's good. So, did that die? Where the hell did that go? Hmm. Anyway. Fragmented... Fragments of faded and within runes descend the length of these broken pillars as the ones we found at the entrance of this level. Was it this level? Was it the previous one? Don't really remember. Let's see if there's anything interesting in here. Some gold. Oh, a rain prism. Let's take care of that. I got an old copper key. Ooh, things are going well, all things considered. Yeah, it's going well. This expedition is proving to be successful. But remember that overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. And if you don't know what a reference that is to... Well, you haven't played or seen anybody play Darkest Dungeon. Oh boy, this might have been a bad... Bad choice, but maybe not. Let's hope that it wasn't. Gorgon is still good on his health. That guy is gone, so you can attack that if you can. Uh, those, they are both injured, though. How the hell did they, are they so injured right here? Did Eloth uh, use his uh, Grimoire Slam or something like that? He has another ability. What's it called? The Arcane Assault. Yeah, use that. Because it makes them prone. Dazed. Yeah, that's dazed. Yeah, that's pretty good. It's a pretty good ability. If this was a turn-based game, of course, I'd be able to use that to Leave much better to effect. And of course, if it were, uh, if it was a, a turn-based game, it probably would have fewer enemies. Because it just would become unbearable, the amount of combat that you have to go through. Uh, yeah, not, not, not that I'm complaining, mind you. I mean, a game like this is supposed to be real-time real real -time with pause. It just, uh, because, it, of course, it's, uh, uh, it has to pay homage to the legacy, right? It's, it's, uh... The new Baller's Gate, they say, they try to create it. I think it has, in many regards, surpassed the, the, the Baller's Gate. But then again, Baller's Gate did have a few problems of its own. But let's not go into there. Let's see what this is. Oh, I, I can't get there. There we go. So this thing is now lit. Have you read? Have, have we read about this before? Because I, I would remember reading about four flames that need to be lit. I'm pretty sure that I'm pretty sure that we have read that. Let me see. Oh, wrong keys all around. So let me see what I have right now. I have this rain prism, which I think goes to the northeast. Unfortunately, I don't have the earth prism. Oh, maybe it's the old key. That's right. Let's uh, save the game again. Let's come back here. Hurry up, guys. There's nobody else trying to kill us now. Unless when we uh, maybe do... S oh, no. There we go. So where's the... Oh, there it is. Put that in there. That's what she said. And uh, thunder. And let's see this uh, little... I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting to f see a battle that will kill me because we you can still we can still definitely um, get through a couple of battles yet. But I just don't know what kind of enemies await us in here. Ah, uh, Inguithian runes, I suppose. These shattered fragments appear to have once been part of a single tablet, smashed atop in a stone, in, uh, atop this stone table. So can I rebuild that? I'm actually pretty good at that, uh, just considering my 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 degree in archaeology. I'm pretty good with uh, rebuilding stuff. It's not that hard. It's just a puzzle. It's just a big puzzle, three dimensional usually, but a tablet really is often isn't. And uh, okay, so we got a unique wand, which is very very nice because of course Elf uh -huh. is still using his crappy S two-handed wand. So let's use that instead. Let's let's compare it. So it deals more damage. It uh, the base damage. 
excuse me, the base damage, uh, it, yeah, it, de it deals one to two more damage. He has, uh, oh, this one does f freeze damage as well. That's pretty good. That is pretty good. And inflicts accuracy minus five. Pretty awesome. Let's use that. Yeah. Oh, wait. What? Oh, cannot apply. I, I was, I, I put it at, over there and that's why it didn't fit. Uh, let's see what else. So hopefully a prism, earth prism or something. Is it prism that, it, that it's pronounced or is it prism? Prism. I don't know. There we go. We have the earth prism. 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 Yep. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Of course, it's way easier to pronounce to you guys, I suppose, than, than, than what we Portuguese call it. But then again, a lot of our stuff... Actually, I was thinking last night, Portuguese. Portuguese is a funny word. It's a funny... A funny... Uh, not word. A funny language. The reason for that is because, for example... Uh, Davos. Davos, for example. Uh, the guy from, from uh, A Song of Ice and Fire. The guy that helps Stannis. Uh, and Stannis, for example, it, it, it ends with an S. And the S is like the um, um, clerical Latin. It's the S. You say it like uh, S's. Uh, but in Portuguese, we don't we don't end words with S with a sibling, that sibling sound. But we, we end it with a sh. Sh. So it becomes Davos or Davos. Yeah, Davos. With the S. It's kind of funny, actually. I, Spanish doesn't do that. Neither does French, as, as far as I can remember. Uh, but it's that's funny. I think we're we're unique in that Italian doesn't do that either because it's very influenced in, by the clerical or ecclesiastical Latin. So the ecclesiastical Latin, if you don't know what it is, is basically how Latin evolved over the years, over a thousand or more years, uh, to become the language that that priests uh, speak to this day and then spoke to a few year, a few decades ago in 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 uh, the masses and stuff like that. Uh, because masses f like 50 years ago and even in, in some oh, what's going on As the game froze No Well I think it has well, I'll join you in a bit and There we go. Yeah, it, it froze it froze it took a little bit though when I restarted the game But I think it got scared. We are now at level 8. Yeah, I think he got scared at level eight, I couldn't. I wouldn't believe. Actually, what happened? Let's go back upstairs and tempt our fate again. <laughs> so yeah, continuing on. Basically, Latin evolved over the years, and and the classical Latin uh, wasn't spoken like. Uh, Leave it, it to me. Like it is spoken, or uh, it was spoken a few years ago by by the priests and people who still spoke it. So yeah, it it changed quite a bit, and there's quite a bit of debate over that. But what happened? What? Why did I do that? That's what I was. I'm here for. Is why did I do that? I kind of forgot. So it didn't do anything, unless something here changed or something. I don't know. Did the tablet somehow sprout to life? Or I, I have no idea. I have no idea. I don't know what that was for. Maybe it debilitates the master. I doubt it would. It probably, if anything, it'd probably make it even stronger. Make him or her even stronger. So yeah, I don't. I have no idea. I have no idea what we just did, but we did it. We did it. And uh, with that, let's go back down. I hope the game is gonna let me. Oh, guys, hurry up! And besides, I have such a. Uh, yeah, there we go. Now, let's go up down there, and hopefully, it's not gonna freeze again. It does take a while. It did take a while though when I when I started the game. Huh? Did it freeze right now? No, we didn't. Okay, we're good. Yeah. So, let me save the game. Right uh, here. Yep. Yeah, I need to remember my keys. Damn it. I, you, it's all because of Wasteland. It's all because of Wasteland. Because of Wasteland. Oh, there's a trap right there. It's going to be set off. Look there. Yeah, indeed. There. Take care of it. Thank you. So, there's traps in here. Perfect. And I hear... Tick, 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 tick. Do you hear that? To the right? steps as well but it might be this little guy so I need mechanics level not I think it's fine I have level so it requires one yeah let's take care of that hope that helps he does help oh by the way yeah do I I don't need to carry this here so I just that's awesome didn't know that okay in there there's a dark hole which is totally fine because they are despite being a bit dangerous they are not that dangerous so let me save again 
Now that we uh, used uh, one, I think it's the first lockpick that I've used in a long, long while. But he's not alone. That Dargle is not alone. There's some vampire or vampire. I don't know what that is. That sounds dangerous. Let's kill it. Okay, it's a ranged thing. It's a spellcaster, I think. Okay, guys, please. Oh, that's too late, I think. Okay. So, as oh, yeah, that guy is charmed. That is terrible. Oh, the symbol is the same as the one in uh, Dungeons and Dragons. Yeah, that is not not a funny. No. Well, I think that means what I think it means. Let's reload the game and get out of here. I forget where, where the uh, where the quick load is, but let's get out of here. Oh boy. Uh, yeah. That, this is a tough battle. It's too tough for me. I need to rest. I don't have uh, healing supplies. So, not healing supplies, camping supplies. And uh, yeah, this map must have something terribly dangerous or something. Might be, it might be the last one. Because the amount of time it takes to load. But it might be just me not being used to it. I don't know. I think it takes a little bit longer. Pretty sure it takes a little bit longer. So let's go back upstairs. We're going to take the master staircase, wherever it is. I don't remember it being at level 5 at the very least. No, wait. 1, 3, and 5? Wait. 7 doesn't have a master staircase access? Well, it's not very far. If I, if I could only access it through the level, this level. So this is, this has a stairs over there. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't. Level 7 doesn't have a master access. A master staircase access. So, yeah. Let's go back. Let's go back upstairs. We have stuff to do up there. I'm gonna rest. I'm gonna do stuff. We're gonna... Actually, I think I'm gonna... What's he called? Uh, raiders? There's raiders, I think, coming to attack us. So I'm gonna rest, wait for my companions to come over, and... Um, so where's the master stake is? There it is. So let's go there. Uh, my companions to come from their... Uh, what's it called? The, the assignments, I guess. Yeah, that's the assignments. And then we're gonna defend our stronghold against the invaders. Is that what it's... I think it's an invasion. It, I think it called it an invasion. So, yeah, we haven't been up there in a long while. Let's go. Yeah. Well, how many hours? Three hours to climb up the stairs? Man, that is tough on the legs. That is really tough on the legs. But, another loading. And here we are, finally. The sound of chirping little birds fills the air, which is very nice. Which is very nice. So, Hello! Oh yes, that's the, that's the ranger, skirmish archer. So let's go in there and, uh, I guess, have a chat with the, um, warden. See if she knows anything about the drake that we found downstairs. We killed everything! We killed absolutely everything, except for that ogre. That ogre didn't die. So we got a valiant shock mage over there, we got nothing else. Yeah, that's fine. Hello, steward, not warden. Why did I call you the warden? Maybe I was thinking of the uh, sanatorium or something. Oh, it is good to see you here, my lady. I can feel a change in the air already. There is much to do. So what's the state of the keep? People are starting to notice you are, your hard works. I dare say we'll have more visitors shortly. I'm glad you decided to stay on, my lady. It's been difficult watching this place tumble into the K time and again. To see it restored is... I can't imagine the, the great crowds, the petitioners, music perhaps, in the evenings? Oh, I've gotten carried away, haven't I? Here's the report. So... Okay, that's nice. So, there it is. It's an attack. So, this one is gonna remove three turns. So, I, I need to wait three days? I'm not sure I, sh I want to. Oh, uh, boy. Let's uh, have buy ourselves... Let's sell ourselves some loot and buy ourselves some uh, uh, camping supplies. Well met, friend. Or I can rest here? I didn't know I could rest here without... That's fantastic, actually. Uh, so let's go. No, I can't. Okay. So order it by sell value, low to high. So I'm gonna sell all of these They're totally wasteful and unneeded stuff. Look at the amount of money I'm gonna make just out of all this crap. And these are just the weapons. These are just the weapons. I don't think I've showed this process, at least this lengthy process before in the in the um, in the playthrough. So how about that? Oh, oh shield wall. Look at that wall of shields. It's like, <laughs> and these are all my enemies. Yep, yep. I, I, I enjoy that it is like this. Because the reason, I said this before, I think. But the reason why they included a stash and didn't go with the traditional uh, party member inventory system. The reason for that, you can still not use the stash or use it to uh, a, a, a smaller extent if you are so inclined. But basically it was to give 
people the choice, the choice to, um, basically, the reason was in, uh, it, they tried to uh, mimic, let's sell all that, they tried to mimic um, pen and paper RPGs, basically. So, yeah, are we good on that? I think, is this that cheap? Oh, interesting. Interesting. Uh, but yeah, they try to mimic um, pen and paper RPGs where you, you usually don't have inventory management. You carry stuff with you, and uh, if you need to sell it, you just say, okay, so we go back to the um, we go back to the town and we sell our stuff. And that's how it goes. That's easy enough, that's simple, and that's, straight, that's straightforward. And you don't spend a needed amount of time taking care of that. So, yeah, that's why they made the, the stash, to try and mimic the, that mechanic in pen and paper RPGs. But, of course, if you don't like it, if you prefer inventory management, which I personally don't, at least not in this game I don't, um, because not in, it's certainly not in, in any Infinity Engine games, let's trade that, and let's buy some uh, camping supplies, let's buy two. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't uh, enjoy that all that much, because, uh, I don't know, it just it doesn't add anything to me. Or for me, I guess. Just, I don't... So I can rest here? Oh, that's way easier. That's very nice. Let's have a nice little rest next to the fireplace. And we're gonna wake up refreshed. And we're gonna get out of here because we need to go back. Oh, Kana finishes escorting Neri, the deft hand. Actually, can't I manually resolve, resolve this with my party in here? Because that would be perfect. That would be perfect, right? I think... I don't know. I, th I read about this... Uh, a while back, and I think it's basically you, you use your hired or hirelings, and you use your unused party members to take care of the attackers, but I, I think that's how you do it. But what if I'm right already here, right? How about we try it out? Let's save the game first. Let's go here. Let's go here. So, manually resolve. Okay. What's gonna happen next? Ooh, they're in here! And yeah, we don't... Okay, so we... Oh, these are my friends. Okay, so yeah, we have friends. And we have only six party members and not... Is... is... What's her name? I don't know, Sagara over here? Or Weber? Brutish? No, I don't see her, so I don't know where she is. But we got forest lurkers, we got shades. Uh, okay, so shades are susceptible to all of our attacks, so let's start with that. I'm also gonna start with summons. Because I want to want to lose as a few people as possible uh, with the uh, okay guys. What are you doing right now? Attack! Attack! Seriously, attack! Like for real. There we go. The reason why they stopped is because they were detecting the enemies first. And I have an option that that tells it to um, stop the the party member as soon as they detect enemies. So that's why that happened. But that's fine, it's fine. We're, we're doing fine right now. Nobody's being damaged, except for... Yeah, he's prone right now, but he's not being damaged. No good to it's no good to you? Who are you, then? Uh, is it you, Kirino, who's, who's not good? Just say the, the word. Let's go with the shade, then. I think it's you. I think that was her voice. So let's hope that we don't lose too many party members. Uh, I mean party members, I mean hirelings. That's what I really mean for right now. There we go, so attack that shade now, and you attack that. Oh, oh he's gone. No, he's not mine. That's... We got a couple of beetles attack. Is that a beetle? No, that's Adapa. Okay, that there's still a shade popping around, which is terrible. Okay, so you can summon your skeletons now. Endurance, there we go. We have another enemy down and only one remaining. There we go. Did you summon your things? You didn't. Why the hell didn't you summon your things? There we go. Now attack that thing. Uh, this guy's injured. I think it's gonna survive. Pretty sure it was... Wasn't he the one? This no, he's not mine. the expensive one. So, how many did we lose? I guess we'll find out. So I'm not gonna be able to loot them. Huh. Well. It's fine by me. I mean, it's just that some of them have uh, had nice ingredients. Oh, I'm gonna be able to loot them. Perfect. Let's take care of that. Oh, let's see. Let's see what we have of here. More shade residue. I guess that's fine. So let's see. How did that go? Kind of is ex so it did she didn't join me. So Sagani is yeah, Sagani, yeah. Sagani is oh we lost one. We lost one. Okay, that's fine. I, I really don't mind. I think prestige is nice. Let's go with prestige. Let's hire this guy. 
I don't think there's anybody better than that, so let's go with that. We have another friend to help us defend this place. And for now, I'm gonna cut the episode right here. I am gonna make my way back to, um, to, uh, what's the name of the city? Defiance Bay, that's right, to Defiance Bay, we need to, uh, oh, there's an orc. A troll? It's a war, a brutish warrior. But it's not a, an orc, what do you think? It's an Awamawa, or however you pronounce that. But yeah, I'm gonna go down there to the Ongris, Ongris Crypt, because uh, that's where we explored Copper Lane. We explored, uh, did we explore the first fires? I don't think we did. But we explored Brackenbury, and we're now gonna explore Hondra's Gift. We still need to make our way back to these two. But that's gonna be for later. For now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Pillars of Eternity, The White March. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye!